Oh, this lemon water is sour. What's up and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name's Amanda and I'm so glad that you're here. Go ahead and make sure you hit that subscribe button before you leave today so that you can come and hang out with me on my channel. We have a lot of fun here. So let's go ahead and jump into today's video. video we're doing another thrifting video but this video is going to be a little bit different compared to the last video that I did so in today's video I decided I was going to go to the Goodwill and see if I could find just a bunch of different pieces that I could work into my wardrobe on a regular basis and so I wanted to show you the different pieces that I picked up and then I wanted to show you after that how I would style these pieces so I know a lot of people are always curious on how I would normally wear an item that I buy or that I pick up and I just thought it would be kind of cool to show you guys how I would style it in my wardrobe that I have right now. First item that I bought was this shirt right here from Torrid. It is in a size two, I believe. Let me see. It is in a size two from Torrid and it's kind of like this really thin kind of material and it has like the seaming like here on the side. You can see like where the seam comes on the side. It's like stitched on the outside and then it has like pretty decent size sleeves that are like looser and then you have like the really really pretty like rose pink rose embroidery and then it says love on it. It is kind of short. I wouldn't call it like a crop top or anything but I would say it's more of like your mid hip length so if you are around the same size as me that's kind of like where it hits me and I just really love the gray and pink together I think gray and pink looks so great together and I don't really have a whole lot of pink or a whole lot of gray I paid only $4.99 for this shirt so I thought this would be cool to add into my wardrobe and then I will show you at the end of the video how I would style it. the next item that I got was this really pretty dress it's like this really hot pink i'm not sure if it's showing on camera but it is a super super hot pink dress this dress is also from torrid it's crazy how many things that you can find from torrid and lane bryant and name brand companies inside the goodwill so this is just a really pretty pink kind of dress it has like a super adorable lacing right here in the front that ties up and then it has a smocked waistband in the back so it's gonna fit a lot of different size people this is in a size two and you guys know that i am super big chested and so this actually fits me really well because it can stretch in the back then it does have spaghetti straps and it comes to just above my knee it's a little bit short so i would definitely want to wear it with like tight at the end of the video i will show you guys how i paired this dress and i think it came out really really cool the next item is this pink sweatshirt it's from victoria's secret and it says pink just like their normal you know kind of style sweatshirt and it doesn't have a hood or anything it's just a zip up and then the collar folds down but what i really liked about it was this really cool like palm print that it has going on and then on the letters it also has that palm print then on the sleeves we have like a gray and white kind of stripe going down and then it does have a front pocket and i don't have a whole bunch of like sweatshirts because it's not very cold where i live and so i can only wear sweatshirts for like a couple months out of the year but i feel like this would be really cool for just kind of like running around town and just being comfortable and like casual cute i don't know about you guys but i'm not really like willing to spend like 65 70 dollars for a sweatshirt just to get the name pink on it that's just my personal preference i mean they're nice sweatshirts and everything but i could go to like old navy and get like just as nice of a sweatshirt for a lot less so that's just my opinion but i mean for 5.99 i feel like that's a good deal i'll pick it up for sure show you guys how i style this at the end of the video so this i've been looking for like kind of a piece like this for a while whenever i go to thrift stores and like whenever i go to regular stores too and i wanted something that was like kind of cool and edgy but like kind of vintage looking and i feel like this is the piece i wasn't really sure how i was gonna style it but i felt like i could totally do something really cool with this piece and i'm really excited to show you it's my favorite thing that i picked up in this whole entire haul and i love it so let's go ahead and show you can't you're not going to get like a really great view of what it is from me just showing you but let me just shut up and show you so it is this 
black blazer. It's a black blazer, but if you can see, it has like a little bit of like leopard print on it or cheetah, whatever you want to call it. I'm not sure what the difference is, but it has this really cool like print on the sleeves and then on the collar and then the buttons are also like bigger buttons. And then it also has it on the actual buttons, which I think is so freaking cool. Then on the sides, it has like, like a little bit of like side slits, as you can see. And I just think this is gonna look really, really cool. Wait till you guys see how I ended up um, styling it. I feel like it turned out so awesome. And I'm really excited to wear this like on an Instagram shoot and actually just kind of wear this out on a date night. I feel like I look really cool and I'm feeling it. I'm really glad I picked it up. And I picked this jacket up for only $9.99. So I'm glad it ended up working out because that's kind of expensive for the thrift store, but it's really cool. It used to have shoulder pads in it, but I ripped them out because I just wasn't feeling it. Oh. To show you. Hey guys, and the last item that I bought were some shoes. So I'm kind of weird about buying shoes. I don't want to get anyone's like foot fungus or anything like that, but I do take them home and like spray the inside and clean them up and everything and then put like foot powder and stuff in them. So these ones, I'll only buy shoes normally if they look like they're pretty brand new. They're not really like that used. I've been looking for a pair of black booties that I could wear with like a lot of different things that are kind of like high heel booties. And I have a pair of brown ones that I love, but I just really wanted to try to find some. So I finally found a pair of black booties and I'm really excited to show you. So these are the black booties. They have like this really cool like braided kind of crisscross straps right here in the front and then a little side buckle. They do zip on the side and then these are about two and a half inch heels which are really really walkable and really easy to actually walk in and everything. I got them in a size nine but they're not like wide foot shoes so they they like run a little bit smaller they are from american eagle and i ended up paying 12.99 for these boots i'm really excited i love how they look with like a bunch of different outfits so i actually styled this to these boots two different ways in this little haul and so now you guys are going to see everything that i tried on and i'm really excited for you guys to see everything okay guys so this is the very first outfit this is how i would pair that gray shirt from torrid I just paired it with like a nice light pink cardigan like sweater that I got from Forever 21 and then I paired it with some dark wash jeans from Torrid that are cuffed at the bottom and then these shoes right here are actually from Walmart. So really cute, love them that they're pointed. They are just like a nice like light blush color and then I did pair it with some earrings. I got these ones from Icing and they were only one dollar they're like these really pretty like marble and like rhinestone I feel like they're really pretty and then I just put on like a cute little headband that's like rose gold and I feel like it totally ties this whole outfit together and I feel like it goes really really well so what do you guys think of this outfit let me know this is how I would definitely rock this top I feel like the pink totally ties in with the whole outfit and there's a bunch of different colors of pink in here and so you can just play with like different tones of color and I'm liking it what do you guys think okay guys so up next this is the pink dress um, it is kind of wrinkly I did try to iron it the best that I could this is the world's most wrinkly dress that there ever was but that's the kind of fabric that it is, but I think it's really cute. And what I did was, as you can see, I paired it with like just a black short sleeve shirt from Target. I've always wanted to do a spaghetti strap dress with like a shirt underneath. It totally gives me like 90s vibes and I'm totally feeling it. And then I paired it with just some black tights from Torrid. And then as you can see, I paired it with those black boots that are from American Eagle that I got in this haul also. And I think it totally makes it look like super edgy. And then because I feel like it's kind of like grunge and like this dress is so feminine, but then this kind of adds like more of like a, you know, more trendy kind of hipster kind of vibe to it. I feel like it makes it more edgy and like kind of cool. And so I added this hat that you guys know I love from Amazon. So this is the look. What do you guys think of it? I feel like it looks really cool because it's such a feminine dress. Like this makes it look like really kind of cool. And I feel like with a 
black leather jacket, which I cannot find mine right now, but with a black leather jacket, this would look really, really cool. I feel like I want to go to like a concert or something in this outfit, but I'm feeling it. What do you guys think about it? Would you wear this outfit? Let me know down in the comments. I'm all about it. I like it. Okay guys, so this is the next outfit. I have on the pink sweatshirt that has like the really cool like palm tree leaf print on it. And then I decided to pair it with this palm tree leaf headband that I got from Shein in my last haul as you guys saw. Then I just decided to pair it with just some regular jeans, some nice distressed jeans, and then I paired it with some gray and white tennis shoes. They're my Skechers, and I think this outfit is really cute, really casual. I like how the headband and the actual like print on the words actually go together. The gray shoes go with the gray and white stripes that we have here on the side, and I feel like this is a really cute going around town casual look. If you're not really feeling like getting dressed up but you still want to look cute and put together, then this is kind of like a look that I would go for um, just to run around town. So what do you guys think about how I made this outfit go together? What do you guys think? Let me know. Okay guys, so I feel like I saved the best outfit for last. I am seriously so in love with this outfit and let me show it to you. So I paired that leopard or cheetah jacket with some really ripped up distressed jeans and then again I paired them with those really cute boots that I got that were thrifted also and look I paired it with like a crop top and I left this button open so you could see like my tummy right here. I feel like that looks really really cool and then I put on my Bellamy bangs because I love how that looks with my Panama hat and then again I paired it with my Panama hat from Amazon and then these really cool like big huge earrings from icing I got them for a dollar and I just feel like this outfit is so freaking cool what do you guys think do you guys think this looks really cool I like cuffed up my jeans at the bottom so I just feel like this looks really edgy and like <laughs> really awesome do you guys like this look? I'm totally going to wear it out like this and I'm all about it. I'm so excited to do some Instagram pictures in this look. I am totally feeling myself and I feel like this look totally came together. So what do you guys think of this look? Do you guys like it as much as I do? What would you change? Would you change anything or do you just love it? So let me know down in the comments and uh, yeah, let's take a look at this look one more time. Okay guys, so that is everything that I ended up picking up in this haul. I got five items and I spent under $50 for all of those items. A lot of times you can't find an outfit for under $50. So I feel like I added five cool new pieces into my wardrobe that I'm gonna get a lot of use out of. And when I'm done with them, I'm gonna donate them as well. So I like to give back to Goodwill. And normally whenever I pick up a piece, I like to donate a piece. So I just went through my closet recently and went through a lot of stuff and donated it so that other people could get use out of my things that I don't wear on a regular basis. Basis. So I hope that you guys liked this video and if you guys did then please go ahead and give it a thumbs up Go like comment and share you guys know that I love making videos for you guys We finally made it to a thousand subscribers. That is so awesome So I will be doing my thousand subscriber giveaway. I have ordered the torrid gift card I will be giving away that gift card really really soon. So stay tuned for that I will do a whole video on the giveaway and yeah, so I really appreciate you guys watching I hope you guys love this video and I will see you guys in my next one and as always Always remember, be your own kind of beautiful and toodles for now. I've always wanted to do a <clears throat> lemon water. Sour, but good for the kidneys. Ah. <sighs>